Bangkok has always been a foodie paradise, with knockout meals on just about every block. While the street food here is still second to none, the city has also reinvented itself in recent years with an outstanding array of fine dining options and great gourmet selections from around the world, and has become one of the world's biggest foodie paradises, and now even has its own Michelin guide. The city now gets visitors coming here solely to fine dine, and while the Michelin choices might be special, don't limit yourself to just fancy, as there are plenty of local places that will wow you just as well. So before we get started make sure to hit that like button. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for our future updates. Number 10. Indus. With one of the nicest restaurant decors in Bangkok and great food to boot, Indus keeps visitors coming back time after time, and sets the bar for inspirational and delicious Indian cuisine. Inspired by an Indus Valley Maharaja's palace, sandstone bricks and an Rajasthan tapestries line the inside of this 1960s Art Deco wooden house, and in addition to the indoor dining, there is a tropical garden and bar with dance floor upstairs. The food is superb, with standouts such as lamb leg marinated in Captain Morgan rum, papaya, and yogurt, and definitely try the signature paneer Kali roll, cottage cheese with onion, pepper and greens wrapped in a tortilla. Sonia Sapru, author of the noted cookbook Zyka, stands behind the training of all the chefs here, and standards are quite high. Number 9. Sawan. There's a reason why Sawan has been awarded a Michelin star by the prestigious Michelin Bangkok Guide. Yes, the name of the restaurant means, heaven, in Thai, and yes, you are going to feel closer to the stars after a meal here, but you also can count on an intimate fine dining experience that features authentic and creative Thai cuisine that is simply some of the best in Bangkok prepared by a wildly talented chef. Sawan's 10-course tasting menu is divided into dishes that represent all of the concepts and techniques found across the board in Thai cooking. It's small and delicate, but packs such a wildly wonderful array of flavors, and sets the tone for what lies ahead. Number 8. Suring. Thomas and Matthias Suring are identical twins as well as master chefs. They have converted their beautiful old villa home in Bangkok into an intimate garden restaurant where they serve German and European fare inspired by their childhood memories and family recipes. The restaurant has been awarded two stars by Michelin Bangkok, as well as well as making it in the top 10 list by Asia's 50 best restaurants. Suring's interior is comprised of a winter garden glass house, which looks out at the garden, along with a living room, elegant dining area, as well as the kitchen where diners can sit at a chef's counter and watch the 9 or 12, Suring experience. Set menu be prepared. Number 7. JFAI. Pad Ki Mao, or Drunkard's Noodles can be found at many street stalls for 30 baht a plate, but for an experience that has been written up by food critics around the world, and now even has a Michelin star, Bangkok's only street food restaurant with such an honor, head over to the Sao Ching Chow district of Bangkok to JFAI. Stuck in one of Bangkok's last timeless neighborhoods, where skyscrapers and designer malls don't exist, JFAI is a small no-frills shophouse eatery. But what sets it apart are the drunken noodles that come with ultra-fresh monster prawns made by an auntie who has been serving the faithful for 60-plus years. Number 6. Nusara. Chef Thitted Tun, Tasanakajan is a fixture on the Bangkok gourmet scene, the man behind the renowned Le Du and Bon restaurants. His newest venture, Nusara, pays homage to his late grandmother, and features classic Thai family recipes that are prepared in 12 course. Set tasting menus which run you through a gamut of different Thai cuisines. The setting is in an intimate dining room that only seats 10 guests, yes, you'll need reservations, and you'll get to tantalize your taste buds with dishes like crab curry served on crispy beetle leaf with caviar or a traditional pad krapao. Thai holy basil stir-fry done with the most tender Wagyu beef. Nusara, like Tasanakajan's other restaurants, has received many prestigious awards, including a Michelin star, and a listing in the Asia's 50 best restaurants, currently ranked at 20 in 2021. Tasting menus here run 1990 baht, and if you're still hungry, you can head downstairs to Chef Tun's Meire Pad Thai, a chic wine bar with good old Pad Thai to go with your drinks. Number 5. GAA. Innovative, elegant, and delectable fine dining has reached new heights in Bangkok with the second edition of the Michelin Bangkok Guidebook's 2019 release. Heading the list of newcomers awarded one star is GAA, which features unique and eclectic takes on both Indian and Thai fare, served up with exquisite presentations and creative techniques by head chef Garima Arora, 
who is the first Indian woman to receive a Michelin Award. Number 4. Mezzaluna. Mezzaluna is Bangkok's most swank restaurant, and dining up here 65 floors above the Chow Freya River and the Bangkok skyline is one of the top experiences one can have while in town, especially as the restaurant has been awarded two stars by the Bangkok Michelin Guide, and features the palate-boggling cooking of chef Ryuki Kawasaki, who has manned Michelin kitchens in France, the US, and his native Japan, and was named Chef of the Year by the Escoffier Society while working at Twist by Pierre Gagnier in Las Vegas. Number 3. Supaniga Eating Room. The quaint three-story shophouse on Thong Lor is easy to miss. It looks so small from the outside, but once through the doors, it is a relaxing and homey spot, probably a recreation of what grandma's kitchen was all about, and. Indeed, the owner serves up his grandma's hard-to-find recipes that he grew up with in Trat, a town on Thailand's eastern seaboard. The menu is extensive here, and has many hard-to-find old-school recipes that will have you ready to come back before you've even left. Number 2. The Local. Owner Khan Markawat and his sister Ploy come from a family of traditional foodies, and they have put their love of traditional and hard-to-find dishes from all over Thailand on display at the lovely new eatery, The Local, where one can dine in a 70-year-old traditional teak home, outfitted with antiques, wooden bird cages, old paddles from the floating market, and bookcases full of Thai cookbooks from throughout the ages. Number 1. Ladu. Chef, Tun, Thitted Tassanakajan heads up. This Thai-influenced relaxed fine dining experience, putting his skills honed at New York's 11 Madison Park to work as he does contemporary takes on Thai classics. The restaurant name is a take on the Thai word, Ru Du, meaning seasons, and indeed the tasting menus here get a heavy dose of seasonal produce and ingredients, all sourced from local farmers, fishermen, and more. The presentations are exquisite, and as Chef Tun is a professional sommelier as well. Needless to say the wine pairings from around the globe are world-class. Le Du has received endless awards, ranging from a Michelin star from the Bangkok Michelin Guide to being ranked fourth on the Asia's 50 Best Restaurants list for 2021. That brings us to the end of this video. What do you think of our video? Let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed the video make sure to hit that like button. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for our future updates. Thank you for watching.